Back in 5500 BC, Polish farmers made an accidental discovery that would eventually become a multi-billion dollar industry. They were storing milk in containers made from animal stomachs, not knowing these contained rennet and enzyme that separated their milk into solid chunks and a cloudy liquid. Those farmers had no idea they just discovered what we now call whey protein. Fast forward to today, and that same liquid waste powers the fitness industry. But the transformation process has become so complex and precise that it would amaze those ancient farmers who started it all. A single dairy cow produces around 30 liters of milk every day, but this massive volume creates an immediate challenge for protein manufacturers. Modern dairy farms operate like precision manufacturing facilities, with Holstein cows bred specifically for maximum milk production through genetic selection programs spanning decades. These farms use automated milking systems that operate twice daily, connecting each cow to vacuum-powered collection units that extract milk directly into refrigerated storage tanks. The challenge lies in maintaining quality across thousands of liters while preventing bacterial contamination that could ruin entire batches worth millions of dollars. Dairy farmers use refrigerated storage tanks that keep milk at exactly 4 degrees Celsius, creating a race against time before the milk loses its protein integrity. The cooling systems work continuously, circulating the milk to prevent temperature variations that would allow harmful bacteria to multiply and compromise the final protein product. You, quality control teams test every batch for temperature, acidity levels, and contamination markers using sophisticated laboratory equipment that analyzes samples within minutes of collection. These tests measure somatic cell counts, which indicate cow health and bacterial levels that could affect the separation process later in manufacturing. The laboratories use automated analyzers that process hundreds of samples daily, ensuring only the highest quality milk advances to protein production. The milk composition reveals only 3% protein content, with whey representing just 19% of that small fraction, making the extraction process critically important for manufacturers. This means that from those 30 liters of daily milk production per cow, only about 171 grams contain whey protein. The remaining 97% consists of water, lactose, minerals, and milk fats that must be carefully separated without damaging the valuable protein molecules. Transportation trucks equipped with temperature monitoring systems carry this precious cargo to cheese manufacturing facilities operating 24 hours a day. These insulated tanker trucks maintain the 4 degrees Celsius temperature throughout transport, with GPS tracking systems that monitor both location and internal temperature every few minutes. The trucks feature specialized pumping systems that transfer milk without creating foam or air bubbles that could denature the proteins. Each step in this chain must maintain the delicate protein structures that will eventually become the concentrated powder in supplement bottles. The proteins contain specific amino acid sequences that provide muscle-building benefits, but these structures break down rapidly when exposed to temperature fluctuations or bacterial contamination. This careful handling preserves the bioactive compounds and amino acid profiles that make whey protein so valuable for muscle building. The real transformation begins when this farm-fresh milk enters the industrial cheesemaking process where separation technology takes center stage. Inside cheese factories, a 5,000-year-old accident becomes a precisely controlled industrial process. But the separation technology would shock those ancient Polish farmers. The milk undergoes pasteurization at 72 degrees Celsius for exactly 15 seconds using high-temperature, short-time methods, followed by rapid cooling to eliminate harmful bacteria while preserving protein structure. This process ensures the milk's safety for consumption and prevents overcooking, which could negatively affect the quality and taste of the final whey protein product. Adding coagulants and enzymes like rennet triggers a dramatic transformation where liquid milk splits into solid curds and liquid whey. But controlling this reaction requires perfect timing. The enzymes cause specific proteins to coagulate and form solid masses, while the remaining liquid contains the valuable whey proteins that manufacturers need. Modern factories use mechanical separation systems that process thousands of liters simultaneously, cutting curds into uniform pieces while collecting every drop of whey through automated collection channels. The liquid whey contains water, lactose, minerals, and the precious proteins, but it also carries unwanted fats and impurities that must be removed before further processing. 
Engineers have developed microfiltration and cross-flow filtration systems that operate at low temperatures to avoid damaging the delicate protein molecules during separation. These filtration membranes have pore sizes measured in micrometers, allowing only specific molecules to pass through while retaining the valuable whey proteins on one side of the membrane. Ultrafiltration represents the most precise separation method, where filtered liquid whey passes through specialized porous membranes designed with specific pore sizes. These membranes allow water, minerals, and smaller molecules to pass through while retaining the larger protein molecules and preserving their structure. Under carefully controlled pressures, the liquid whey passes through the membranes, concentrating the whey proteins on one side, called retentate, while filtered components like water and lactose collect on the opposite side as permeate. Ion exchange technology offers an alternative method that selectively isolates specific protein components using specialized resin beads. The liquid whey passes through columns filled with ion exchange resin beads that attract and bind to targeted proteins while leaving behind other components. Once the proteins attach securely to the resin, they are carefully released by adjusting the ionic levels of the surrounding solution, resulting in a protein-rich solution ready for the next processing stage. Quality Control Monitors Protein concentration levels throughout the separation process, ensuring consistent results across every batch produced. The resulting whey protein has less fat and lactose while maintaining complete solubility with a clean and neutral taste. This separation stage transforms ordinary milk into a protein-rich liquid that contains the building blocks for muscle development. The filtered whey liquid now moves to the concentration phase where water removal technology will create the powder form consumers recognize. How do you remove water from liquid whey without destroying the proteins that make it valuable? And why does this process determine the final product quality? The filtered whey enters evaporation chambers where controlled temperature removal extracts excess water while maintaining protein integrity through precise engineering. Large evaporators heat the concentrated whey under specific conditions, gradually removing water while preserving the protein structure and nutritional value. During evaporation, the liquid becomes thicker and more concentrated as water turns into vapor, leaving behind a protein-rich substance. Too much heat destroys the amino acid structure, while insufficient drying leaves moisture that causes spoilage, creating a narrow window for success. The evaporation process requires careful temperature monitoring to protect the delicate proteins from damage. Engineers maintain specific heat levels that remove water effectively without breaking down the valuable protein molecules that consumers need for muscle development. Spray drying technology atomizes the concentrated whey into tiny droplets that encounter hot and cold air streams in carefully designed drying chambers. The concentrated liquid whey gets broken down into tiny droplets and sprayed into a large chamber where hot air flows continuously. The droplets transform from liquid to powder in seconds, with temperature controls ensuring the proteins retain their bioactive properties and nutritional value. Hot air causes the water in the droplets to evaporate rapidly, leaving behind dry whey protein particles that maintain their original nutritional composition. The precision of this process requires meticulous control of temperature, airflow, and droplet size to ensure the final powder has the correct texture and dissolves easily. Industrial sieves with 2 mm openings remove larger particles and ensure uniform powder consistency, while mixing drums eliminate remaining moisture through rotation. The powdered whey passes through these sieves to achieve size uniformity and remove any clumps that could affect product quality. Quality control teams test protein content, moisture levels, and particle size distribution using laboratory analysis to verify product specifications. These tests ensure that the final product meets required standards and maintains consistent quality across every batch. The resulting powder contains 90% protein concentration, representing a dramatic increase from the original 3% protein content in raw milk. This concentration results from the filtration, evaporation, and drying processes working together to remove water and other components while retaining valuable whey proteins. Automated systems weigh and package the powder into moisture-resistant containers, maintaining quality through controlled storage environments. This drying process creates the shelf-stable protein powder that delivers concentrated nutrition in convenient form. The final stage involves blending this pure whey powder with flavors and additives to create the consumer products found in stores. Why does transforming bland whey powder into flavored protein products require the same precision as pharmaceutical manufacturing? And what secrets do companies guard about their mixing processes? Protein factories like MyProtein operate 24 7 
handling hundreds of tons of raw whey powder and producing thousands of different flavored products daily. These massive operations require sophisticated equipment and careful coordination to maintain production schedules while ensuring each batch meets quality standards. Creating consistent taste across massive production runs while avoiding cross-contamination between allergens demands sophisticated separation and mixing protocols. Variations in flavor or the presence of allergens can lead to customer dissatisfaction and potential health risks, making these protocols critical for manufacturers. The facilities use dedicated production lines for different allergen categories, with thorough cleaning procedures between batches to prevent contamination. Taste panels with trained volunteers score each flavor formulation on sweetness, bitterness, texture, aroma, and appearance before approval for mass production. These evaluators undergo specific training to recognize subtle differences in taste profiles and provide consistent feedback across multiple testing sessions. The panels test hundreds of flavor combinations, with only the highest scoring formulations advancing to commercial production. The weighing rooms use precise measurements for each ingredient, with flavoring compounds added in specific sequences that companies keep as closely guarded trade secrets. The order in which raw ingredients are combined is a closely guarded secret, contributing to the unique qualities of the final product. Each ingredient requires exact measurements to achieve the desired flavor profile, with digital scales accurate to fractions of grams even when handling ton-sized batches. Rotating drum mixers blend ingredients slowly and methodically, ensuring homogeneous distribution of flavors throughout tons of whey powder without creating heat. These mixers rotate at controlled speeds to prevent friction that could damage the protein structure or alter the flavor compounds. The mixing process can take several hours for large batches, with operators monitoring consistency throughout the blending cycle. Automated filling machines dispense exact amounts into containers, followed by weight verification systems that reject any packages outside specification limits. These machines can fill thousands of containers per hour while maintaining accuracy within narrow tolerance ranges. Laboratory testing conducts final quality checks on protein content, flavor consistency, and safety standards before products receive approval for distribution. Each container receives labels with nutritional information, expiration dates, and batch codes that allow traceability back through the entire manufacturing process. The labeling systems print unique identifiers that connect each product to its specific production run, enabling manufacturers to track ingredients and processing conditions. This final assembly stage transforms industrial whey powder into the consumer products that fuel fitness goals and muscle development. The completed journey reveals how ancient accident became modern precision manufacturing that delivers consistent nutrition to millions of consumers worldwide. From 30 liters of daily cow milk to concentrated protein powder represents one of the most complex food transformations in modern manufacturing, requiring precision that would amaze those ancient Polish farmers. The journey involves sophisticated equipment, controlled temperatures, and exact timing at every stage to preserve the valuable protein molecules that consumers need for muscle development. The next time you open a protein container, remember the industrial symphony of separation, filtration, drying, and blending that created each scoop. This manufacturing complexity shows how everyday products often hide sophisticated engineering processes that transform simple ingredients into specialized nutrition for millions of people worldwide.